San Diego Comic-Con might be over for another year, but there was plenty of exciting news and amazing trailers released over the weekend to keep us going until next year. Don't worry if you missed anything though, because we're about to catch you up on the seven biggest things that happened at San Diego Comic-Con 2018. This is gonna be fun. We got our first proper look at new Doctor Jodie Whittaker thanks to a trailer for Doctor Who Season 11. And not only did Hall H erupt with cheers as the first female Doctor took to the stage, but she also treated fans to her first look at her new sonic screwdriver. New worlds. New times. So if I asked really, really nicely, ah! <sighs> would you be my new best friends? As if there aren't enough Star Wars movies and TV shows in development right now, Comic-Con also witnessed the revival of animated series Star Wars The Clone Wars, which was cancelled back in 2013. Fans will finally get a satisfying ending to Ahsoka Tano's story and were treated to this teaser trailer to celebrate. Alright Rex, what's so important that you brought us all the way back here? Hello, Master. The Walking Dead fans waited with bated breath for a first look at Season 9, which they got, but the big news of the panel was Andrew Lincoln confirming that Season 9 will be his last. Both the actor and fans in Hall H got a bit choked up as he announced the news, but he also said, we're deeply, deeply proud of the work we've done this season. It's about all of us, together. Keep doing that, they'll see we're all on the same side. same side, right? Star Trek Discovery also released a flashy first trailer for its second season, which co-creator Alex Kurtzman teased for around January 2019. But the big revelation everyone was talking about were all the potential spoilers which came out of the panel. Dr. Culber is apparently back despite dying in the first season, the Federation version of Lorca might be back, and that one and only Spock will put in an appearance this season too. Let's find out. Aye, sir. Six seconds to impact. I am in total free fall. Trust us. Discovery has you. Right, ladies? <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah, absolutely. M. Night Shyamalan showed us the first look at Unbreakable and Split sequel Glass, while Warner Brothers treated fans to a first trailer for Aquaman, Shazam, and Fantastic Beasts The Crimes of Grindelwald. Are you a ghost? No, I'm alive, but I'm an alchemist and therefore immortal. Oh, Nicola Flamel. Jacob Quas. Oh, oh. Yes. In terms of exclusive Hall H footage which won't be released to the public, Sony debuted some Venom footage which teased other symbiote, Riot, and when asked about a possible confrontation with Tom Holland's Spider-Man in the future, director Ruben Pfizer said, at some point down the road they're going to run across each other's paths. Hall H also hosted an exclusive look at Wonder Woman 1984 which saw Gal Gadot's superhero taking on two baddies in an 80s shopping mall. During the panel, leading Lady Gadot said, it's not a sequel, it's its own story. And as for the elephant in the room, director Patty Jenkins didn't directly address Steve Trevor's return, but she did say it's a very important part of our movie. And that's all the biggest things that happen at this year's San Diego Comic-Con. Let us know about your favourites in the comments below, click the boxes on the left for more content from us, and don't forget to hit that big button in the middle for more entertainment news, reviews, previews and features right here on GamesRadar+.